Hi everyone, welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be going through a short but relaxing yoga sequence you can do in your bed. This is perfect to do before going to sleep. So go ahead and find a comfortable seated position. Make sure you have a pillow or two handy nearby. And just take a few normal breaths here, breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. Bringing your awareness into the space, relaxing into your body. Taking a few more deep breaths. And once you're ready, inhale, reach the arms up overhead. Exhale, planting the right arm down, left arm comes up and over. Coming back through center, dropping the left arm this time, and bringing the right bicep to ear, keeping the sit bones grounded, gaze is soft. One more time on each side, bringing the right arm back down. Placing the left arm down, reaching the right arm over, and coming back to a neutral spine, and using our right hand, wrapping it across the body, bending the elbow, and gently massaging the left traps. So kneading that muscle in between the neck and the shoulder. And gently working your way down onto the shoulders, the deltoid, massaging the arm, the biceps, and then moving down to the forearms, massaging the wrists, and then working into the palm of the hands. Switching sides, so using the left hand to massage the right trap. Working out any tension or tightness. Moving down to the shoulder. The arm. And then the forearm and the wrist using your left thumb to massage the palm of the hand. Good, coming back to a center position. We'll inhale, reach the arms up towards the sky, interlacing all of the fingers, finding seated cats and cows, so drawing the fists away from the body, then reaching the fists back up. So inhale, reach the fingers high. Exhale, round through the spine, drawing the chin to the chest. Inhale, reach the arms up. A few more times at your own pace. And then release the fingers, bringing the hands back down, coming into a Baddha Konasana, bringing the soles of the feet together and then gently massaging the arches of the feet, pressing the thumbs into the outer edges, working your way up to the ankles, the shins, moving on to the thighs, the hip creases, and then grabbing a pillow nearby, placing it long ways on top of the feet, Readjusting your sit bones here if you need to. And then once you're ready, finding a forward fold. Placing your right ear on top of the pillow. Gazing towards the left side. And coming back to your breath.
switching your gaze, bringing the left ear on top of the pillow and focusing on your inhales and your exhales. Slowly make your way back up. Coming into a child's pose, drawing the knees together, big toes touch, keeping the pillow long ways, and then forward folding, placing the right ear on the pillow. Allowing your body to sink into the prop. And then switching your gaze, bringing the left ear on top of the pillow. One more breath here. And once you're ready, slowly making your way back up, moving the pillow to the side, and then make your way onto your back. Hug the knees into the chest, Wrap your arms around your shins and gently rock from side to side. Bring the feet back down and then we'll find a supine pigeon pose. Crossing the right ankle on top of the left knee. Holding here if you feel a deep stretch. Otherwise, you can interlace the fingers around the top of the left knee and then draw both knees close into the body. Getting a stretch in the right hip, releasing any tension in the low back. Relaxing the facial muscles, the jaw, the cheeks. And then placing that top foot down, just finding a gentle supine twist. One more deep breath here. And crossing the top foot and switching sides. So crossing the left ankle on top of the right knee. Holding here, if that feels deep enough. Or bring the right heel closer towards the glutes. Maybe interlacing the hands behind the back of the knee. And repeating the same variation. Taking a deep inhale here, and as you exhale, finding a gentle twist, dropping the left foot down. Coming back through the center, uncrossing the left foot. And then as you're ready, extending both legs straight out in front of you, allowing the arms to rest along the sides with the palms faced up, preparing for our final resting pose, Shavasana. Allowing the body and the mind to fully rest. And feeling your body grow heavier, sinking deeply into the bed and the support beneath you. And feel free to stay here for as long as you'd like. Thank you so much for joining me. Namaste.